Today I'm going to show you how to move pictures from your camera, your digital camera, onto your computer. I'll be using both a Mac and a PC so that you can see both methods. But first, let's just assume you can't find the cable and uh, we have to remove the SD card from the camera. The first step is to remove the SD card. For this camera, it's inside the battery port. When we open it up, we'll find the SD card. We push. Because it's spring-loaded, it pops out and we are now ready to insert it into a computer. Most modern laptops today have an SD card reader built right in. So what we're going to do is we'll take our SD card that we've removed from the camera and insert it into the computer. Once inserted, we wait and the SD card shows itself on the desktop. Here it's labeled Canon DC. When I open this up, I'm going to see a series of folders on the inside that are finally going to lead me to my pictures. This is when you can copy these pictures uh, into your, your folder uh, where you keep your pictures. So what I like to do is open up the Finder. And once I have the Finder open, I will go to My Pictures. And inside My Pictures, I will create a new folder that new folder I can simply call it uh, down or imported pictures and then I will make a folder on the inside of that with today's date so with a new folder I will check the date the today's date is Sunday October 13th so I will just type in uh, 10 oops 10 dot 13 dot 2013 and then what that will do is it will automatically start to arrange my my photos in the correct order. Uh, some people actually prefer to put the year first. That's entirely up to you. So once you've got that folder open, you can open up the SD card, find those pictures that you've just taken, highlight and copy into that folder, and those pictures will be copied over. That's how to copy them into a Macintosh. On the PC, the process is a little bit different. When you insert your SD card, a dialog box will appear. It will ask if you'd like to import your pictures and videos. If we select Import Pictures and Videos using Windows, a dialog box opens up. We can add additional tags, or we can simply hit the Import button, and it will import our pictures. And there they are. If you had have checked the box, it will also erase them from the SD card for you. At this point, it will create a new folder inside your Documents folder where you will find all your pictures. 